episode i want you to have your notebooks with you because we are going to talk about the 2017 nissan note and this is the basic variant of the nissan note and the nissan note comes in very many variants we have the digs we have the medalist we have the rider and many other variants we also have the nismo variant of the nissan note which is the performance variant and this specific nissan note is brought to you courtesy of impact motors in kiambu road and if you want to buy this specific nissan note it is on offer at 1.25 million kenyan shillings and you can also finance it by bank and you can have this car to be yours so as we dive deep into this car ensure that you have subscribed and let's get to the video and so we are going to start by looking at the front profile of this car and as we focus on the design of the 2017 nissan note the basic variant you see that a lot has changed from the previous variant and it looks really attractive and one thing guys is that the selling point of the 2017 nissan note is that this car comes with bigger spaces than their competitors it has competitors like the honda fit the toyota vits the mazda demio amongst other cars in this category so the headlights over here are really technological they have the projector lamps and the daytime running lights that goes all the way like that and as you come to the middle part of this car this part is really stolen a lot guys so people who buy this car take this car so that these parts can be riveted down that way if a thief comes they will not steal we have vents over here with the nissan badge and we also have uh, this part where if you pop out you can hook your tow hook and you can be towed so the number plate goes here and not much going around we have the chrome accents that you know they collaborate well with this car so with that being said let's look at the side profile of the nissan note the 2017 variant as we move to the side profile of the nissan note you find that it has kind of a longer design compared to its counterparts like the honda fit and the mazda demio and the toyota vits and i repeat this is the selling point of this car it has a lot of space inside we will look at that later and also this car is a car that you know can be used for day-to-day -day activities and so this car is a car that you know if you have it uh it doesn't need that much of maintenance apart from the cvt transmission that it comes with so one of the features that we see from the side over here is the side mirror that has the light strip it's kind of thinner than the previous variant of the nissan note and you also have the door handles that pop out and it also has a button to it that you don't need to bring out the key you just press and the door will open or close so let's go and look at the back profile of the nissan note the 2017 variant As we move to the back profile of the 2017 Nissan Note, you find that this car has a good design compared to the previous variants. And you know, we have a style over here that makes this car to look attractive. And we have the Nissan badge over here, the Note badge. And you'll find that other cars will have the DG DIGS badge over here the rider or the medalist badge so the premium variants of the nissan notes have a higher price range to them compared to the basic variant this one is the basic variant of the nissan note and as i open the boot you find that the nissan note has a lot of space over here which can carry a lot of luggage 
and as I open the lower part of the boot over here it doesn't come with a spare tire but it comes with a tire compressor and it comes with the tire repair kit which is not really recommended so if you buy the Nissan Note the 2017 variant you will have to purchase an aftermarket spare wheel such that if your tire bursts or you get a puncture you will be able to act on it accordingly so let me just close down the boot of this car and one thing that I want to tell you guys about the Nissan Note is that it has a lot of hate and love at the same time because of the extronic gearbox that comes with the Nissan Note so what people don't understand is that it comes with a CVT gearbox and the CVT gearbox is a very sensitive gearbox in that you do not want to miss on the service and you also don't want to put the wrong CVT fluid on the Nissan Note so it has a tendency of overheating when you miss the service or when you put the wrong CVT fluid and what you need to do to these CVT gearboxes is that you need to install an aftermarket CVT cooler if you get the Nissan Note with a CVT transmission and you are doing long distances. Before we get to the interior of the glorious Nissan Note, we must check the engine. The engine of the Nissan Note comes in either a 1.2 liter and a 1.6 liter. And we also find other variants of the Nissan Note like the medalist that comes with the supercharger mated to the engine which gives it a punch of power so if you want the performance variant of the nissan note you can get the one with the D digs or you can get the nismo variant which is much expensive so if you can afford it you can get it As I start on the interior of this car, we find that this car has a lot of space by the way. That's the first thing that I note as I get into this car. My seat is pulled all the way back and you know it has that kind of a long dashboard design. That way if I sit here as a driver, I feel like I have a lot of space by the way. And just look at the legroom that I get in this car. I get a lot of legroom and also i get pretty much good headroom and this car has a very nice view it has a big a big window for the driver and it also has kind of a slanted windshield which gives good visibility we also have these ones that you know they help to eliminate the blind spots for this car so overall this steering has a really good design to it and a sportish feel to it that way if i'm driving you know i can hold it with one hand and i can also hold it with two hands like this that's the traditional way in which a steering wheel should be held and onto my right over here this car comes with pretty much some technologies being a basic variant it comes with the idling stop that you can turn on or off it also come with the collision detection assist it comes with the lane keep assist it also comes with the traction control which you can turn on or off we also get a dial over here that you can raise or lower the beams of the headlights which is really nice we have a nice metallic knob over here to open the door which is standard on all nissan notes we also have the buttons for the mirrors we also have buttons for the windows and this car does not have much going on it has those things that are crucial for a typical car so onto the center console part over here we have the vents the hazard light we have the radio the climatic control you know the dials over here and the shifter for the CVT transmission and so this car also comes with a traditional handbrake which is a good sign we also have a 12 volt socket over here most cars have them at the front over here and uh, cup holders 
over here we also have a cup holder at the door over here and quite a number of storage spaces this is the, how the key of the nissan note looks like and uh i can keep it at the cup holder part over here i can keep it here i can keep it behind here this car has a lot of space by the way that's the selling point of this car we also have the rear view mirror over here which gives you a good view to the back of the car which we'll just look at in a moment we have studying lights up here that you know if you want to sign papers look at things that are not visible at night you can just turn it on and you can put it at the door position whereby if you open the door it lights up if you close it it will just turn off automatically so sun visors over here that you know they have a mirror that i can look at myself as i'm going to work and uh there's not much going on at the front over here let's hop in at the back seats and look at the space that the back seats have as i said earlier the selling point of the nissan note is the aspect of space and look at all the space that i get inside this nissan note headroom is good legroom is plenty i even have space underneath the seats that i can put my feet under we can also carry three passengers here comfortably and you know this car has kind of a tunnel over here which is not really high and that is the selling point of this car this car has really really good space if you having a young family and you're looking for a car to start with as your first car you can consider having the nissan note which has a really good reputation for you know space as i'm seated in this car i can go on a fairly long road trip quite comfortably and you know i will be comfortable that means that you know the boot space of this car is also good considering that the driver seat has been pushed back and the passenger seat is just as it should be we also have quite a big boot space behind there and this sums up the nissan note that has been it for the nissan note the 2017 variant the basic variant and you know we bring to you these reviews courtesy of impact motors and you can support us guys by subscribing to our channel and you can also go and follow our instagram at petrolet underscore ke you can follow our tiktok at petrolet underscore ke we'll post this car and you know it is on sale you can come and buy it and comment down below which car you want to see as a review next time and with that being said we will see you in the next episode. Peace.